welcome to another video kite surfing strapless progression and i'm hoping this wind is not too much for the microphones in my gopro so it doesn't distort too much the audio and to kick off this video i'm going to show you how to self-launch a kite let's go here's my bar as you can see on the floor i've got everything set up so let's start with the foundation what do you have to do in order to be able to self launch the kite well first of all you need to know what you're doing so if you're a beginner you never done it with your instructor or the person who's teaching you basically don't do it if you've got the person with you use an assistant now let's say you are at the independent level where you know what you're doing and maybe you're not even kiting you just want to see how to do it so the first thing we need to establish where the wind is coming from so it's right in my face so in this occasion it's coming from the west we can even call it slight northwest wind so as you can see my leading edge so that tube at the front is facing directly the wind and a good way to see where the wind is blowing from is try to feel it with your face and once you feel that now move about and try to feel the wind going through both of your ears now you know that you're directly facing the wind and if you open your arms that's gonna be the edges of your wind window on one side and the other side so as you can see on this spot the beach is quite narrow so basically what i'm doing is i am going to be launching the kite from this position so i'm gonna go towards the sea and i'm gonna be launching it towards the dunes which is not the safest way but i'm not what i'm doing and the reason why sometimes we do that is because this beach gets smaller and smaller sometimes so it's impossible to launch it in a safer way which would be towards the sea i mean the kite towards the sea and me walking towards the dunes so as i said i'm gonna do the opposite so i'm gonna leave the kite towards the dunes and i'm gonna walk my way to the edge of the water now what else do you want to make sure as you can see now the kite is in the park position what does it mean park position leading edge facing the wind and also i've got the sand securing the kite you see so the sand is enough sand to push that canopy down to the to the ground and i've got it on both sides when i'm gonna be launching the kite which is in a minute what i'm gonna do i'm gonna get rid of the sand and as i said my bar is there more or less where that yellow bin is there where i'm pointing so i'm gonna walk my way from there to the left which would be my right to the shore to the edge of the water so what i'm gonna do i'm gonna put the sand on top of this tip so the tip which will be further away from you is the one which you want to secure with the sand during the self launch as i said again this is parking position so park the sand on in the middle on a canopy kite ain't going nowhere okay so i'm gonna prep for my launch i'm gonna get rid of this sand so now i'm releasing the parking position and i'm gonna use this tip which will be further away from me as i'm gonna make my way down to the bar and during the launch i'm gonna walk to the side down there so this is gonna be further away from me as you can see as i'm putting the sand on top of the wing tip this part is moving upwards right there's no more sand on the canopy the wind's going underneath it so the idea is to pull that tip around as i'm gonna work, basically walk my way down there and bring the kite to the c position to allow it to get into that launching position at the edge of the wind window so c position so we're gonna look into that in a minute by the look of it the wind is not as strong as, as forecasted as predicted but i'm all ready to go so i'm gonna walk my way you see there's the kite 
So I'm gonna walk this way. There, to the side of the wind window. To the edge of the wind window. And then, we're gonna allow the kite to go into a C position and get it up into the air. So let's see how this looks. Also important point is that you want to keep some tension in the line especially because I've got this safety line attached and if I don't have any tension in my lines that safety line is coming out okay so let's have a look how this looks see what I'm doing I'm allowing that kite to turn by pulling that that tip which is further away from me okay it's going to C position And we up in the air so you see as simple as that but it takes some practice you know so you want to pull that line which is further away from you and then let the kite to open up a bit you might have to walk slightly over upwind and then bring yourself back down slightly to downwind position to let it kind of open up and grab you know some 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 of the wind but basically Keep some tension in lines as you're walking around as well. Okay, let's go. And again, I'm on the strapless board. No leash anymore <laughs> for the board. So, as you can see, the leash is detached. Now, let's go. Ever since my eyes met the world, I was breaking through the chains like a match to a flame. I was born against the grain. Oh, oh. they say I'm broken in the brain. Got a shot of kerosene in my veins. Hey, hey, hey. There'll be concern now, cause it's my turn. And I'm only getting hotter. Take a step back, or you might get burned. Cause I'm a fire starter. From the trenches and the fumes Got defiance in my bones To the soles of my shoes And oh, oh I got a thirst for breaking the rules You can try me, but I got a short fuse Hey, hey, hey There'll be concern now Cause it's my turn And I'm only getting hotter Take a step back Or you might get burned Cause I'm a fire Since my eyes met the world, 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 world,
since my eyes met the world. Whoa, 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 whoa. Born against the born against the born against the brain of us. Don't stand back or 